A Wim Bridge uh, oscillator core is given. Clamping circuits are not shown. Assume that the time constant tau RC equal to one second is normalized. If the circuit is oscillating somehow with a constant stable amplitude at V uh, at uh, of, of one volt at V out, so we have constant oscillations here. And then the amplitude is one volt. And this is V out. What is the amplitude of the signal at VA? So what is this this amplitude? In other words, what is the transfer from V out to VA? And uh, if we look at the circuit, what we have is an impedance divider. So I can draw only this part here, V out. Then I'll have this ZS, which is basically um, 1 over SC. This is the impedance of the capacitor plus R. And then I'll have another impedance, which is ZP. And um, it will be 1 over uh, YP, and uh, it will be uh, equal to 1 over now I have uh, the conductance of, uh, of the capacitor plus the resistance something like this because here C and P and R are in parallel so now my my, my question is reduced if uh, uh, this is one volt what is this this voltage so let's see uh, then uh, I can write the current, and the current is uh, simply V V out divided by Z S plus Z P. This is the current, and if I multiply by Z P, I'll get simply. So if I multiply this current by this impedance, I'll simply get V A, what I need basically. So let's uh, let's solve this. Then uh, V A is uh, V out. 1 over ZP is YP, which means that I can do ZS YP plus, and this is 1. Then uh, ZS is simply this 1 over RC, SC plus R times YP is, um, is this thing plus 1. So for sine wave signals, for sine wave signals, I can substitute that S is J omega, and this becomes the imaginary part. And for uh, signals with stable oscillations, to find the transfer, I equate the imaginary part to zero because there must be no phase, sh uh, phase shift in order for the circuit to oscillate, which leaves me only one option: that V A is actually one third of V out and this is this answer VA is one third of V uh, out and if V out is one volt VA will be one third yeah. again what I did is that um, I analyzed this impedance divider like this so VA takes a portion of V out and this is uh, here how I uh, expressed it so I get an expression in S domain and at the frequency of oscillation if I if I substitute S with uh, J Omega for sine wave signals J Omega 0 uh, at Omega 0 the imaginary part must be 0 because I should not have a phase shift. Uh, my wind bridge here in, the, in this feedback has no phase rotation. So this is a real number amplification. 
and then this means that the phase rotation from the output here to this input should be uh, n times 360 degrees so for example zero degrees and uh, this will require the imaginary part in, uh, in, a, in, a, in the complex expression of uh, the transfer of this uh, divider is uh, zero, the imaginary part is zero. If I equate then uh, the imaginary part to zero, I'll have uh, simply one third, and uh, this is a good answer. Thank you very much.